So my latest of many channels, Jack Sucks at Geography, is still great, it's got 93,000 subs, but it's been brought to my attention that there's a lot of fakes out there. Look at this, who are all these scumbags? And this one in particular, they've got their sub count hidden, so we can't see how many subscribers they've got, but look at all their videos. This fake Jack Sucks at Geography has more videos on it than the real Jack Sucks at Geography. And they're getting bloody views as well, look at this, 1.5 thousand views, 1.3 thousand, nearly a thousand there. Let me just have a little bit of a watch because uh yeah basically they've just re-uploaded my old GeoGuessr videos in just kind of crap quality what's it say here this is another re-upload i'm going to upload all my old videos before i make a new one and then they've had the cheek of adding a stupid little upwards emoji tell you what though re-uploading my old videos not a bad idea can i do that is that an acceptable thing to do L let me know <laughs> I tell you what's the most annoying, I'd argue that this thumbnail is probably better than my original thumbnail. <laughs> no wonder it's got 1.3k views. So this thumbnail they copied from my video, you can see that there is actually the original YouTube timestamp behind because <laughs> they've just screenshotted the thumbnail. But then they've been getting a bit creative and they've been redoing the thumbnails themselves and they've actually done quite a good job on them as well. What are people saying in the comments? Are people understanding? Oh, little scaredy cats. They've got their likes and their comments to see. Let's check the about section. For business inquiries, view email address. You are kidding. Oh, brilliant. The fake Jack Sucks of Geography is going to get a brand deal before the real one does. So, today we're going to find out how easy is it for me to get the videos on this fake channel deleted. Because, you know, they have stolen my content at the end of the day. Which, you know, I'm not bothered, but it is wrong. And it is within our right to get this channel taken down. So let's find out how easy it is to do that. But first, make sure you subscribe to this channel if you are not already. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. So in the new YouTube studio, there's all of these usual things, you know, the dashboard, the videos, playlist, analytics, but there's also this copyright one. And what it does is it literally scours other videos on YouTube and finds your content within those videos. And you can see that Jack Sucks at Geography pops up here and it gives you a percentage of how much of your video matches their video. So the Jack Sucks at Geography one, 100% of the video is the same because they've literally just re-uploaded it. Now this one says 90% and that's because this is from a channel called Distracts with Health Bars. And what they've done is they've re-uploaded my Skeppy diss track and they've added a, like a little health bar at the top so when I diss him his health like goes down a little bit so it's very similar to the same video but not quite that's why it's 90% side note me and Skeppy are friends the diss tracks were, were just like a fun little thing we did ages ago can Skeppy's fans please stop telling me that I suck and that I'm irrelevant and that my channel is dead every day <laughs> So what I could do is on this Jack Sucks at Geography video, I can move it to the archive, which just gets rid of it from this section, so I don't see it anymore because it's not relevant for whatever reason. Or I could request that the video is removed, or I could contact the channel. Obviously, I just go mental and request that the video is removed. I've never done this before. Oh, bloody hell. Editor Thomas, you're going to have to blur all this. So because it's like a legal thing, my phone number, my name, my address, it's all in front of us right now. Relationship to copyright content. Content creator slash owner. There we are. Videos requested to be removed. You know what? Let's add all of them. So we'll select all of the fake Jack Sucks at Geography's videos, which apparently is these four. Okay, here we go. Request removal. I have never copyright striked a video before. This is a new experience for me. It's very exciting. I feel like Jake Paul or something. Removal timing. Scheduled. Send a seven day notice. Once the request is validated, YouTube gives the uploader seven days to remove the video and avoid a copyright strike. If they don't, the video is removed after seven days. Or Standard request removal. These removals can lead to a copyright strike. YouTube processes the video removal after validating the request. Do we go big and get this channel striked? It feels mean when I say it out loud, but they have literally created this channel because they knew that I was about to also create a channel with the same name and they saw an opportunity to get a bunch of free views. It's literally my content. I'm striking this channel. And if you don't know, you need three YouTube strikes before your channel actually gets deleted. So this one strike, it's not going to delete their channel. I mean, they should really delete their channel. They've stole my stuff, but whatever. I have a good faith belief that the use of the material in the manner complained of is not authorized by the copyright owner. To be fair, it isn't. I did not authorize this. The information in this notification is accurate and under penalty of perjury. Oh, perjury. That makes more sense. I understand that abuse of this tool, such as submitting removal requests for content that I do not on may result in the termination of my YouTube account. This is all fine. Signature. This is a legal document now. Things have gotten serious. <laughs> 
Do we click it? Let's click submit. I've gone for it. I'm scared. I don't know if it's like an instant thing. I assume there's someone from- I've just gotten an email. Thank you for your submission. It is under review to ensure it is valid. Okay, we'll uh, we'll find out what happens there. Is there anything else in here that um, shouldn't be around? So I've no issue with the diss tracks being re-uploaded. That's fine. Uh, this guy re-uploaded a deleted video on from my channel. That's also fine. Five YouTubers that accidentally broke stuff. Let's give that a watch. <laughs> Who else is in this? PewDiePie. Oh, is this where he broke his million awards play button? You know, I'm Here we go. Of this <laughs> Oh, that's really sad. Where the bloody hell am I in this? Where, where is it? Wait, does Markiplier break his play button as well? But anyway, we're going to be doing monthly live streams. Oh, oh no. That's what happened. Knock the diamond loose. <laughs> Bloody hell. People just don't look after their play buttons. Send them to me. I'll look after them for you, Mark and PewDiePie. Right, board. Let's get to the good stuff. Here it is. Here it is. Oh, I see what this is. So coming in at number two in the video, we have an insane clip from a YouTuber known Jack Sucks at Life. What happens clip. is he ends up using a golf club and he lets go of it while he's swinging it and ends up going flying in the air and he ends up hitting his girlfriend's sister's vehicle right in the in the front <laughs> windshield. So it was New Year's Day and I thought, let's have a game of golf. <laughs> so I had my little golf club. It was a safe distance from any vehicles or any windows. I was pointing my golf ball in the direction of the fields. I took a big old swing. I accidentally let go of the golf club. It goes hurtling behind me into the air, at least three to four miles in the air, I presume. A look of panic glazes over my face as I realize it is now hurtling at great speeds of up to 100, 150 miles an hour <laughs> into my girlfriend's sister's car window. <laughs> Big old smash. What a start to 2019 that was. 1st of January that happened. Thanks for shoving us in that one. Brilliant. What's this? This is another re-uploaded GeoGuessr video. So I think this guy also renamed themselves as Jack Sucks at GeoGuessr. And you can see that their profile picture is still the same. But it looks like they've gotten scared and they're in the process of rebranding themselves. Oh, what? Seeing as it was just the one, I was going to be fine with it. First ever video, subscribe, 1.8k views, two weeks ago, first GeoGuessr video on new channel. Let's get them terminated. <laughs> Request removal, please. Submit. There it goes. Get it sent. I'll be interested to see how long this process takes of striking a channel. Let me get this saved so I can save the link. Very exciting. Oh, hello again. So I was expecting it to be like two days before I recorded this little follow-up bit. It's been half an hour. Literally within half an hour of submitting that claim, I got this email. Hi, Jack Sucks at Life. Thank you very much for your notification. The content has been removed. It's gone. So this is what the fake channel looked like half an hour ago and this is what the fake channel looks like now so like four videos have been taken down interestingly these two videos are still up and once again they are just you know copied stolen content the quality of them isn't great like look at that look at me little blurry face so i'm wondering if potentially the quality is so bad on this video that youtube's system can't recognize it so it doesn't pop up in my dashboard maybe that could be the case i don't know so i did bookmark one of the videos what happens when we click on it oh this video is no longer available due to a copyright claim by jack massey welsh i have never seen that goodness me i feel like i've turned to the dark side or something i don't like it i don't like it at all that's scary that okay this is another guy that stole a bunch of my videos let's do a little refresh see if anything's different there's less videos once again but still two stolen videos are still on the channel i wasn't given the option to delete these ones in my dashboard. Wait, 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 hang on. They might have just popped up. This is his two videos. Let's get them deleted. <laughs> We may as well get all of them at this point. Let's go for it. There they are. We'll go with instant removal. There we are. Just whack all this in again and we'll just click submit. We've gone absolutely mad with power. <laughs> Why did he have to change his name to this? I feel like I have to be careful with his name. But the thing I like about, we'll just go with Squidward. At least he knows how to spell GeoGuessr. Cause the fake Jack sucks at geography misses out the E every time. Come on, man. What are you playing at? So in conclusion, seems pretty straightforward to take down stolen videos. If you are the fake Jack sucks at geography, it's a bit rude to try and get some free subs and views and stuff, but I'm not bothered. I'm not losing any sleep over it. Just stop doing it, I guess. Really, I just wanted an excuse to copyright claim someone because I've never done that before and it's it's rare that you get the opportunity to. But yes, make sure you subscribe to the real Jack Sucks at Geography. Let's do a refresh. We're on 93.5. Is it going to go up at all? Oh, it's gone up to 93.5.
93.7. We're very close to getting another one of these little cheeky fellas, a silver play button. And uh, at the time of recording, I've done one video, so that's just mental. Do I have to keep uploading once I had 100k? I just want an excuse for another play button. Please don't make me actually put long-term effort into this. Thanks a lot for watching. Subscribe to Jack Sucks at Stuff as well if you haven't already. And I'll see you later. So it was New Year's Day and I thought, let's have a game of golf.